Hey everybody, it's the Silly Nerd Show! Hi YouTube! So, um, I just got back, it's like 10.06 and I'm making this video real quick and then I'm gonna edit it and put it up tomorrow, Friday. Today's Thursday, the 18th, and I just saw, for the second time, Red, R-E-D, or sorry, R-E-D, Retired and Extremely Dangerous, with Bruce Willis, Morgan Freeman, and a bunch of actors I know, but don't know the names of. For example, like, my favorite character, the, the crazy guy, um, yeah, he's like, uh, like, my favorite lines would be like, um, he, uh, when, kind of like when they first get introduced, him, was like, I haven't said this in a long time. I'm getting the pig. And actually, it's like a stuffed pig. It's so funny. Anyways, and then there's uh, the, like a, towards like pretty much the end, he shoots the guy who's been shot already. And then Bruce Willis' character's like, "You good?" And he's like, "Yeah." Let's go get pancakes. He's just he's crazy and he's hilarious. I love it. The whole movie laughing the whole time. Second time seeing it, still laughing, still going, "Yeah!" Like awesome. Go see it if you haven't seen it. What's wrong with you? Go see it. Red. In theaters now. Seriously, go see it's the funniest movie, the most action-packed, awesomest movie. My mom doesn't like a lot of movies. She loved this movie, because I just saw it with her, because she hadn't seen it yet, and I was like, Mom, we gotta see this movie, it's so good. I like milk. And guess what else I got today? See my beautiful oil paints, beautiful, all water washable, or say water mixable, I guess is what the technical term is, but it can wash away with water, won't damage my palettes or my uh, brushes or anything of the sort, and I got some new brushes, except I forgot those downstairs and I'm too lazy to go downstairs and get them, seeing as to I have to make this video real quick, like I already said. So I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18 tubes of 12 milliliter um, oil paint that I anticipated this price, this amount would be like 50 bucks and when I got to Wallach's start store and I looked at the family box, it's not in the box now obviously it was there and the little price tag below it said 47 something which would be like a little over 50 bucks of tax I go to the cashier and I'm like spending all my money because <laughs> that's all the money I had left Anyhow, so I'm like, put it on there, and I'm like, hmm. And then she's like, okay, it's 1522. So I also bought the canvas. And I'm like, okay, 1522 for this and the canvas. She made a mistake. Yeah, I went through the, like, the, the beepy, you know, the beepy things that usually go off. Nothing. I look at the receipt. Oh my god! It was only 13 bucks! Yes! Awesome! So I went out and I bought socks because. Sock Monster's been attacking my wardrobe! <sighs> Damn you, Sock Monster. I go kill him now. <sighs> he got away this time, but next time I will get him. Anyway, so, yeah. So I got socks. I got even a frame for her because it's actually a size bigger than what she requested. The, my client said she wanted an 8x10 paint, oil painting of her stepdaughter on a horse and she sent me the picture and it's ever so quaint. Anywho, yeah I do more, well, actually since I haven't shown you yet, uh, this is choice giving, uh, okay this is fate giving choice to innocence, my most recent painting. Here's a clip of me trying to show you the sketch, the um, well, my preliminary sketch which is just an outline, like not, not even any shading, it's not like a real sketch or anything, of the painting I'm doing. So, I don't know how well you'll be able to see it on the webcam, so I'll just show it and see. Ooh, you can't see that. Hold on, maybe if I put it in the shadow. I don't know if you can see that. Hold on, maybe if I... No, hold on, maybe if I pulled it out some. And did that. If I held it here, you can kind of see that it's like a little girl looking up at this figure holding two apples yeah I don't know how well you can see that but oh well you get the basic idea I'm gonna be showing you guys the painting once it's done and, and here is the actual painting finished product it's a really crappy quality
quality picture. I'll try to get better quality soon. But, uh, because there's the fluorescent lighting and shit-tastic camera. But here's the best qualities I can manage of the painting. So yeah, I mean, I, it's more I'm more in surrealist type thing. The only painting I've really done that's oil as of yes, she's meant to be fate giving choice to innocence. Cloak figure holding the apples is fate and innocence is the little girl with the teddy bear leaving it behind to leave your childhood behind. It's a huge slumbless work and holy shit, I gotta get to bed. <sighs> Being humans on right now. Okay, well, I gotta get to bed. So.